Welcome back and thank you so much for staying with us as we continue to tell your story. Now, family, friends and the entire football fraternity gathered today to pay their last respect to football icon Mark Bachelor, who was shot and killed outside his home in Lone Hill last week. The funeral, which uh, was initially uh, scheduled for uh, Friday, was moved to today out of respect for music icon and legend Johnny Clegg, whose memorial service will be held on that day. A somber moment for brother Warren, the family and bachelor's gardener, who was with him when he was gunned last week Monday. Sean Bartlett, Mark Williams, Mark and Neil Tovey and Paul and Nzanya, some of the country's football legions were in attendance to pay their last respects. The 49-year bachelor was described by his pastor as a kind-hearted and generous person, which was in contrast to his tough persona during his playing days. To the family, the brutal murder of Bachelor is a painful reminder of the high crime and they pleaded with authorities to do something about it. Even though this had a double hop on my brother's violent tragic ending, if we have to celebrate his life, but the crime in this country is out of control and something needs to be done. Too many beautiful people are dying. What is being done about this? We have to do something. How many more funerals do we have to have? Bachelor belonged to an exclusive group of players who have donned the jerseys of the top three clubs in the country, Mamelodi Sundowns, Solando Pirates and Kaiser Chiefs. Birch, as he was affectionately known, was part of the Pirates team that won the league in 1994, the CAF Champions League in 1995 and the Super Cup the following year. His former teammates shared light-hearted moments and memories they shared with the blonde-headed striker. We, we had a good time. I was the little striker. He scored beautiful goals. When he was needed most, he took us to Africa. He made, he made us want the star. We want the league locally. Now, best one, it always invited me for a coffee. And I said, listen here. Now, Sean Barkley is saying, hey, you know, they used to go to the gym. Now, in Cape Town, we have two different types of colors, the English one and the cross. And I said to him, best, if you want to have a coffee, you have a coffee with best, sir. For me, we go for a drink. <laughs> and we used to laugh and things like that. The Premier Soccer League was represented by Chief Operating Officer Ronish Laws. Pesinka, ABC News, Mitrand.